Alright uh, guys, I'm just gonna kinda go through and bring up some something that people will probably wanna know. These ones are short, short cut edge. Unless no, it looks like it was cut. Yeah, that was cut. Broken off. But uh Yep, that was cut. But I'm just gonna show you a couple of things that people ask me and I kind of tell them what to do and kind of use so that they do kind of know different ways that I catch fish. I know my ways are kind of crazy the way I rig stuff up but it's different. They don't always use the same thing when you're fishing. Like with jigs. Jigs, you can pretty much kind of modify it to anything if you want to. So, with jigs, you can pretty much go on, like, not, not with that though, but say, with a wacky worm. Your sinkles, you do with those, or even these. I've had all the stuff I have had for quite a while. I believe I need new stuff because these are all dry, but they're not to the point where they're cracking or anything like that. They just need to be dipped back in some oil. Uh, get that out of the way here. things are pretty weird. Oh, which is supposed to be like, a, it kind of reminds me of a squid, but I got this already set up and I've used it quite a bit. It's got the flat top on it right there, so when, you, when it goes down, it kind of drags across the bottom. It's not round like this one is that they gave me with it. But these these type of hooks, um, they do come with them. You do get like this one here, the weed guard. I don't like the weed guards. I pull them out. Don't clip them off because then it leaves it sharp. Just take it and just just pull it right out. It'll make it a lot easier, and you don't sit there and have something sharp. And the fish will grab onto it. They feel that they're gonna fuck all right away. But yeah, these here. Look for these. I don't know the name of them. I don't have the package. I've had these for a couple years. So look for those if you like to use those. Those are pretty cool. I know they've got so many products of worms out there, and not a. You don't see every worm that they have on the market. Um, people will be like, oh hey, I've never seen that before, so hey, let me go check something out like that. So, it's a good way to also share your, your tackle with people. You let them kind of see what you have, and you know, we're here to help everybody out who's out there kitchen. And we're well, here to help the beginners so that they can have a better fishing story than success too. And who knows, then I become pro. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I got two two that I haven't used and seen in years. Holy cow.
Alright, back to what I was going to do. Okay, guys. Let me take some of these away real quick. So I'm not sitting out. If you don't want to use a gig head on some of them, and you just want to be kind of creative, but there's these ones here. They come in the packages, so you get two of them. You get them with the weed guard this way, or you can get them with the weed guard this way. And I don't like the weed guard, but or you can get they, they come in two different ways. They come in. I don't know if you guys can really see them, but they come in with the hook that goes like this, or they come in with the loop. So the one with the hook like that, it's, it works pretty good, but these ones work also. I think the wider the gap, the easier it is for you to lose that fish. Um, I think with the closed in a little bit more, you're going to have a better hook ratio than having it be wide, like too wide. There's one like like this. This one here is wide. This here I would use for northerns, bigger fish. Even if you're gonna go put like a big sucker on there, medium sucker or a large sucker, put on here. That's what I would kind of use this with, since the hook is pretty dang big. Um, you're obviously not gonna throw it on. on a tube. What, what would it look like with being on a tube? No. It's just sitting on here so I thought I'd just experiment with it, but yeah. I mean this <laughs> yeah, that looks weird, doesn't it? But if you're going to sit there and jig up and down for it, like you do with the spoon, try it. Who knows? Might get a good size nose on with it. Yeah. I wouldn't use it with that. I just thought I'd see what it looked like. But where is it? Okay, right here. Now, this would go, these two, just had it. Okay. Okay, you guys, why just put it? Oh, it's hiding. These two go with this, for sure. Now uh, there's something else. Oh. No, not that one. There's something else that goes with it. I can't remember. Oh, and, but anyways. Um, then. Also. Got this here too. It doesn't have a skirt on it, but. I'm not a fan of the weed guards. Weed guards, no. I've just never had luck, and I'm really not a jig. Or flip with them. I'm not really a flipper. Like that, right there. 